Saint Stephen, Disciple, Martyr, Finding, 415, Kafar Gamala, Jerusalem. In the year of our Lord 415, in the reign of the Emperor Irinurius, a priest named Lucian, dwelling at Kafar Gamala, about 20 miles from Jerusalem, received a message from God, in consequence of which discovery was made of the bodies of the Saint Stephen the First Martyr, Gamaliel, Nicodemus, and Abibran, the son of Gamaliel, which had long been lying unknown and unheeded. Lucian was asleep when Gamaliel appeared to him in a dream as a tall comely old man of worshipful presence, told him where the bodies were lying, and bade him go to John, Patriarch of Jerusalem, and deal with him that they might have more honorable burial. When the Patriarch of Jerusalem heard it, he called together bishops and priests from the neighboring cities, and betook himself to the place, where he found the tombs hewn in the rock, and a right sweet savor flowing forth from them. The thing being noised abroad, a great multitude of people came together, and many that were sick and weak of diverse diseases returned home whole. The sacred body of Holy Stephen was then carried with great pomp to the Holy Church of Zion. Under the Emperor Theodosius the Younger it was taken to Constantinople. And during the Pope Adam of Pelagius I, it was brought to Rome, where it has been laid in the sepulchre of the Holy Martyr Lawrence in the Varanian field. O Remus! Grant, we beseech thee, O Almighty God, that we who keep the birthday of thy blessed martyr, Stephen, may be so hope and by his prayers, that we may ever grow more and more in love toward thy holy name. Through our Lord Jesus Christ thy Son, who liveth and reigneth with thee, in the unity of the Holy Ghost, one God, world without end. Amen.